Hello, I am Dr. Dhruv Zurchi. I am a senior consultant neurologist. Now, today I will be talking just in brief about the symptoms and triggers of migraine. So, commonly, as we generally would like to read and believe, that migraine causes hemicranial or one sided headaches. However, the important thing to note in this is that the headaches keep changing sides, so it's not always on the same side. It can also change the sight of the head. That means it may not always be limited to only one half. It can be in, include the whole head or can occur in the frontal part of the head or in the hind part or the occipital part of the head. Generally, these headaches are long duration headaches. By long duration, I mean these headaches last for three hours and longer. Sometimes even can go up to days. The common symptoms which are experienced by the patients are nausea, vomiting, sensitivity to light and sound. Patients become very irritable. They feel extremely lethargic, exhausted. Most often the patients have to stop their ongoing activities, go into a room, lie on the bed, take some rest. Quite often the patient sleeps. Following that, the patient starts to expect or experience some kind of relief. Generally, a lot of patients who are experiencing a severe throbbing headache will eventually end up taking a analgesic or a painkiller, whichever suits them. Now, regarding the type of headache, it doesn't always mean that a migraine should be a throbbing or a bursting headache. A lot of patients just experience some kind of heaviness over the head, some uneasiness over the head. Some patients even experience some kind of sensation in the head, like something is moving in the head or something is just imbalanced in the head. So various patients may experience different symptoms. However, a throbbing kind of headache is the most common type of symptom experience. Now, what are the common triggers experienced by migraineurs? In general, the common triggers are hot weather, hunger, lack of sleep. In females close to the menses, in the perimenstrual period, the headaches become very severe. Any kind of exhaustion or physical stress and emotional factors also play a very important role. There are some dietary triggers also that are experienced by patients. These include spicy food, some patients have uh, sensitivity to caffeinated drinks, so after taking uh, hot coffee or, uh, or a cup of tea, they may experience a headache. Alcohol can act as a trigger in headaches. Then a lot of these migraineurs also have a very heightened sense of smell, as a result of which some of them notice that with a strong sense of strong smell like perfume or any other noxious smell, a severe headache gets triggered. Hence, a lot of migraineurs complain that they can't even apply perfume or any kind of deodorant or even can't tolerate others using perfumes. So these are the common triggers. Other than this, individualized triggers can be experienced by patients themselves and have to be noted by patients and which because this helps in preventing further attacks as they can avoid these triggers. Thank you.